Attention, if you're building a brand, don't forget to do this. Come on. Don't forget. All right, <laughs> yes, if you're building a brand, a personal brand, uh, a product brand, whatever kind of brand it is, don't make the mistake of forgetting this. It's so important. And what it is, is it's planning everything with the end in mind. It's kind of like if you were to just build a house, mm. like you're like, I'm gonna build this house for just, it's gonna be beautiful and amazing. And then you're not thinking about the end goal of like, who's the house for? Um, did you think about like, if the house, if you're building it for, let's say your grandma, and maybe she doesn't want a five story house with five stairs to go up and down. Um, and like the balconies with, with, or like you're building it for a family with kids. Like, you know, those modern balconies that have no edges, like no family's gonna want that. Right. So it's building your brand with the end goal in mind. And what do we mean by the end goal? We mean who you are going to serve. That's right. Know them. Yep. Know them like you know That's right. your best friend. Sorry, exactly. I'm hitting the mic. No, it's all good. So just like she said, it's exactly right with the end goal in mind who you're serving. Because yes. just like she said, if it was you were serving your grandma and you're helping her build her new incredible dream home, because it's gonna where she's gonna spend the rest of her life. It is important. What does she desire? What is she wanting, mm -hmm. right? And can she manage to get around with five stories? No, yep. absolutely not. Yeah. So why would you ever do that to a client, right? Or someone who you're working with, or why would we ever do that to anyone who we're supposed to serve? Yeah, right? and you might be like, but, but I think that they like this and I like this yeah. and uh, this is important to me and it, I can't even tell you how many like, yes, that, and that can be true that like who you want to serve is someone very similar to yourself. True. And if that's the case, awesome. Mm -hmm. But if not, still find out, even, I should say not, if not, even if it's similar to yourself, mm -hmm. make sure you still understand what their pain points are, what their problems yes. are, what, what's current right now, what is, what are they wanting right now? And, and so you're tailoring your brand and your messaging to what they're wanting because sometimes it can surprise you on what you think they want or even like this is something for us we laugh about all the time is what people need mm -hmm. and what people want can wow. be something totally different wow. so if you know that they're like it's kind of like if you know someone needs to lose weight mm -hmm. and they need to exercise um, and do the things that we all know we need to do but still that hook and what you're drawing them in with mm -hmm. isn't going to be just eat right and exercise every day mm -hmm. like that's boring. No one's going to hook yeah. on to that. You've got it. So you've got, you know what they want, know what they want. That's kind of the hook and draw them in, mm -hmm. but then you can package what they, what they need. We're kind okay. of digressing. We're getting into it, but well, don't forget this. If you're building your brand, especially yeah. if you're in the beginning stages and even if you've already built one circle back, it's worth it. Tie in to right. who you want to serve, know them, know what they like to do, know what they like to eat, know what they, yes. the hobbies they have, know them so that you yeah. can, package your brand your offer and everything to speak to them to hit on their problems their pain points if you don't do that your marketing is going to fall flat true. your sales that you're going to be wondering why am i just plateauing why can't i go to the next level yeah probably because you're not you haven't positioned yourself oh. and your product and your brand to speak to pain points mm -hmm. speak to the problems and have imagery and have the whole experience be something where your ideal customers and clients are resonating with yes so if you need help with this what do they do that's time to click the button below right or the link there's a link there's something there for you ready to yep. go to go get a connection point between us so let's yep. get a call let's yep. get on a call let's work it out dialogue through it or there's a PDF as well, right? Heck yeah, heck yeah. So download that PDF, go through it. It'll help you in huge ways. And I got the hint there, love, talking about watch your weight, watch your eating, get to the gym. I got it, I got the hint. She not hey, we're both, we're both working on it. Man, we're so, we're both jamming. So, yes. yes. So today is what? Today is the day to take action and change your life forever. That's right. You guys, it's up to us. It's up, we, yeah. it's us. It's We have to take ownership of where we're at. If we want things to change, then we need to take action and make the change and not tomorrow. None of this tomorrow. Do something right now after you've watched this video, whether it's scheduling that, that 15 minute call with us, whether it's getting that PDF, whether it's yeah. do something right now, take action. Keep going guys. Let's go.